Hi YouTubers, RV Debs here. It is uh, Saturday afternoon about uh, 1 o'clock and I've been just cleaning the house up and I actually got some paints out and I've been painting. It's not done. But um, yeah, painting. <laughs> pretty good for me to get it going because it sure has been a while um, and I just I don't even know what I'm doing it's a Sun mr. solar face so I hope you're doing well this is a, a, an overcast day starting to drizzle and it's supposed to bring a cold front in and we're supposed to get down tonight uh, starting Sunday I guess in the 30s at night um, but then it's going to bounce back up again. So that's fine. I've got a great heater. Works really well. So well that I have to turn it off. So I'm spending the day painting. And um, I did my laundry yesterday. Finally put it all away. Changed my linens. Don't you sleep so much better on clean linens? I know I do. The dogs are rested. We've gone for a walk. So that's good because it's starting to rain. And uh, I've been listening to different videos of the people that I do follow. And there's been some really interesting discussions. There was a hangout with discussions of men and women. And uh, I could relate to one of the guys. He had lost his wife, who he feels was his very first and last love, you know, soulmate. And, um, you know, it gets you thinking about it, like... What do I want? What do, what do we all want out there? We want to feel needed and loved. And no, you know, you can't replace a soulmate. You don't replace anybody. Everybody's different. I don't think I'd ever find another man that I loved the same way as I loved my husband, Mark. I mean, he was not only a, he was a passionate, fun-loving, loyal good man and we had a chemistry that was undeniable I don't see anyone in my future right now uh, but I definitely need friends and that I have would I like to have another companion in partnership yes I would who wants to walk through the you know the complete life without anyone to share it with but I I am picky because I I know what it's like to have a good friend and good mate but I'm open-minded about it. I wouldn't even mind somebody that had their own motor home and we just traveled together as friends and companions. But that's just, I mean, who knows what's going to happen. I'm very grateful that I'm here for the winter. Uh, do I think that this is the place for me to stay? No, I really don't. I love the RV park and I, I adore a lot of the people here. But uh, it's not for me forever, no. So, I am going to be looking into moving out in spring and uh, heading west. Not sure where and how and all that. That's just going to have to come on, you know, just happen naturally, I hope. And I'm really glad I'm painting. It, it, you know, I'm looking at the painting now. It looks like a, 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 a kid's painting, but... Well, this is the beginning of it. She hasn't got her eyes yet. Eyes help. She's a sunflower god. <laughs> I don't know. Just enjoying that I'm finally getting the paints around me and, and uh, just beginning to try to get back into it. It's a beautiful, beautiful time in my life. I mean, I'm retired. I don't have to go anywhere at any certain time usually. I do like it and this place here you know it's small it's easy to clean I do wind up getting a little bit like I have to get out and I do that's when I get out and go take a ride or walk over to the clubhouse and see if anybody wants to visit for a while but mostly I really am a loner I would love to be with my mate again that was so nice because we were both homebodies and we just loved each other's company and um, 
it's hard. It is. And men, you know, certain kind of men I couldn't find attractive. And I'm sure certain men, they would don't find me attractive. So it's a real, it's a real hard road when you're, that's why I'm not looking. Because when you're looking, you don't find anybody. Uh, everybody here is nice. I like Larry. He's a great guy, but he's not a mate. He's not someone to partner up with. Definitely have different belief systems, but good guy. Nice guy. Um, I'm going to make some spaghetti sauce that I had left over and make some pasta tonight. Thinking about inviting Larry. He's the only one really that I, you know, enjoy enough to want to sit and have dinner with, but even if I'm here alone, it's okay. I got the dogs. Lily, you want to come here? Come say hi. This is Lily Bell, my baby girl. And Rosie, you can see her over there, her white head. Oh, I love my babies. They're my babies. Yep. Here's Rosie. Say hi, Rosie. Yeah, she's a side. I don't think so. Well, another day. That's what happens in life. They go right in. One day goes into the next. Can't believe it's like the weekend already again. Stay warm. I know it's cold down here tomorrow. Cuddle weather. So I'll cuddle with the pups. Take care, everybody. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do. I've got lots of videos, and you can look back and see that I downsized, sold my house, moved into an RV, got from Florida to Alabama, and from Alabama I'm heading west come spring. So hang out with me. Comment, subscribe, thumbs up. Thank you guys. Peace out.